This video demonstrates endovascular retrieval of a 7 cm wire fragment from the left lower segmental pulmonary artery. The patient is a 45-year-old female who had previously undergone difficult portacath placement. The wire fragment embolized due to sharing of the wire after manipulation within the access needle. Postoperatively, on routine imaging, CT chest revealed a 7 cm wire fragment in the left lower segmental pulmonary artery. At that time, the patient was asymptomatic but desired to have the wire fragment removed. Seen here on the axial cuts, there is no evidence of extravasation or pulmonary embolism. Therefore, the plan was to take the patient to the operating room for retrieval of the 7 cm wire fragment. We accessed the right common femoral vein on the ultrasound guidance. This was done with a mini stick needle followed by the wire and a micropuncture sheath. We then upsized to a six French sheath over a wire. This soft wire was introduced into the left main pulmonary artery, which was exchanged for an Amplat super stiff wire over a catheter. We then introduced an eight French by 90 centimeter sheath into the left main pulmonary artery. Pulmonary arteriogram was performed, which showed filling of the main pulmonary artery as well as its distal branches without any active extravasation. It also confirmed the seven centimeter wire fragment in the left lower segmental pulmonary artery. We then carefully introduced our wire into the left lower segmental pulmonary artery. This is followed by advancement of the end snare catheter into the left lower pulmonary segmental artery as well. Repeat angiogram confirmed placement of our catheter within the left lower segmental pulmonary artery. Next, we advanced our end snare into the left lower segmental pulmonary artery. The wire fragment was then captured in the end snare and withdrawn into the sheath as shown here. Once the wire fragment was retrieved and externalized, repeat pulmonary angiogram showed filling of the main pulmonary artery and its distal branches without extravasation and successful retrieval of the wire fragment. The wire fragment is seen here. This concludes our demonstration of an endovascular retrieval of a 7 centimeter wire fragment from the left lower segmental pulmonary artery.